Hi, I'm Jacqueline Pung and this is Making the Call. Lady Luck was conspicuously absent at Bajaya Sports Toto for yet another quarter. On Friday, B Toto reported a 30% drop in second quarter net profit, dragged mainly by a higher price payout ratio. Net earnings fell to 70.7 million ringgit. Revenue was higher though at 1.4 billion ringgit. Despite the lower earnings, B Toto declared a second interim dividend of 5 cent. B Toto is the largest numbers forecast operator in the country in terms of outlets and product offering. It has a market cap of 4 billion ringgit. Now, Kananga Research is expecting a slower year come FY16, but because of BTOTO's wider offering spread, it says the company's estimated price payout ratio is still less volatile compared with Magnum. Still, it's trimming its estimates for FY16 by 6.7% and FY17 by 0.8% because of lower ticket sales growth. It's cutting its target price for BTOTO from 3 ringgit 72 cent to 3 ringgit 56 cent. Meanwhile, Hong Leong Investment Bank doesn't see a catalyst for BTOTO in the short term. On the numbers forecasting front, the company is facing higher competition and a challenging economic environment. The research house is lowering its earnings forecast for FY16 by 19.2% and FY17 by 18.1%. It's a whole call for BTOTO, target price 3 ringgit 10 cent, down from 3 ringgit 21 cent. BTOTO's results may have been below consensus expectations, but Afin Huang says the numbers were in line with its estimates. It expects the company's earnings to remain subdued due to the impact of the GST, competition from illegal operator and lower spending power. Still, it says its dividend yields are respectable. It's retaining its whole call for the counter, target price 3 ringgit and 5 cent. The stock is currently trading at 3 ringgit 3 cent. And that's it for making the call. I'm Jacqueline Peng. Thank you for watching.